All the college football teams in the state have started camps. We heard from the Utes and the Cougars and the other Division I program, the Utah State Aggies. They are underway as well. They weren't happy with the way last season ended, and they're using that as motivation. Yeah, I see a chip on their shoulder a little bit. That's it's easy to see. Hopefully everybody in our program, including me, has a why. You have a why you do it. And then um, that chip motivates you. You always want to improve, uh, get better. You get the whole summer to work. Uh, but yeah, especially coming off a loss, coming off two losses right there at the end of the season, um, we know we gotta we gotta come out here and work and uh, be able to finish games. That's something we weren't be, we weren't able to do last year. I feel like not just the last game, but kind of the last string of games and the close ones that we lost has been a big uh, impact on us as far as. Um, our determination and our mindset. It's just the way the year finished. I mean, getting beaten the last minute in the last two games, I think, has motivated all of us in the offseason. Another reason for optimism for the Aggies is the fact that they're returning 18 starters this season, something Coach Wells says puts the team way ahead of schedule. It allows you to start faster, probably um, you know, be a lot more organized. Uh, they should know what we're doing, but those returning guys need to take a step forward in their individual development. Just because you have returning starters doesn't equal wins. It's a big difference when you have people coming back who already know what to expect and so they know how to prepare better. We got 18 starters, we, returners. We got a lot of people that have uh, played. They've uh, their experience. So, I mean, uh, they know what they got to do uh, to get better. So, I mean, it's a good vibe out here. Everyone's that much further ahead in their, in their playbooks. We know a lot that's going on already. We can do more in our scheme. Um, it's, it's better for the young guys coming in. We have more guys teaching them, so they're catching up at a faster rate. You have so many people that have been in those positions starting ready, and then a lot of guys that are, are competing for them, so it's just making everyone better.